Five, we reported a teen has been arrested in connection to a shooting and killing of a dog in southwest Amarillo. News Channel 10's Sydney Batslav joins us now from Heritage Hills neighborhood. Sydney, how are neighbors there reacting tonight? Greg, residents in the Heritage Hills neighborhood are in shock after Sunday's horrific event. Emerald Police Department tells us it received multiple calls Sunday after midnight about dogs being shot and suspects fleeing the scene. We spoke to neighbors who watched it all unfold. We do want to warn you, some of this video may be disturbing. The Law family tells me they came home Sunday to see their dogs got out of the backyard. Immediately, they started searching and asking neighbors if they've seen their two dogs, Pearl and Sadie. Uh, what I saw was two dogs running through this neighborhood, but I couldn't tell exactly what they were. It was uh, five minutes right after she left over there at our neighbor's house that we heard roughly around six to seven gunshots. Pearl, the family's lab, was shot and killed. Blood still being seen on the sidewalk. I was sitting there with the dog and I just started breaking down crying because I was watching this dog dying. Sadie, the other dog, made it out alive, but the family says she is traumatized. Several agencies responded. Police say an 18-year-old man was found and detained between Lexford Drive and Heritage Hill Parkway. Another man, 17-year-old Armani Kavion Kayshawn Thomas, broke into a home on Lexford Drive. Once officers were called, he fled and was later found hiding between two homes. It bothers me that we couldn't have done more. We did all that we could. We just couldn't do enough. This here on your screen is our money, Thomas. He's been charged with discharging a firearm into a municipality, cruelty to non-livestock animals, criminal trespass of a habitation, evading arrest, and unlawful carrying of a weapon. Police say the other suspect was released at the scene. Now, residents we've been speaking with tell me the one question they have is, why were these men in the neighborhood? I did reach out to police asking them this question. They tell me they don't have an answer at this time, who these men were or why they were here, or what their motive was behind the killing of this dog. But for now, reporting live in Heritage Hills, Sydney Batsoff, News Channel 10. Greg, back to you.